It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. Hey guys, Tyler here. Throughout the entirety of 2020, as well as most of this year, we've been entirely on lockdown throughout most of all this craziness with the pandemic and the coronavirus and blah, 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 that basically things got boring super fast. And so naturally people wanted to do some stuff that's fun entertainment, like of course play outside or go to whatever park, talk to family in a very restricted way, of course. And of course, play lots and lots of video games. Tons of video games. What is like on the console or the PC or whatever kind of device. Gaming, you know, kill like a lot of time for most people. That in movies. Although we play games to pass time, it seems as still that the mere idea, the idea of wanting to play games is also a big no-no. Because you see, the government knows everything, and so therefore, the government must tell us what kind of games we could play and what kind of restrictions we have in our bedroom. So ladies and gentlemen, what exactly am I talking about? Well, I'm talking about the ban for PC gaming in at least six different states. Dell is no longer shipping high-end gaming PCs to California, Colorado, Hawaii, Oregon, Vermont, and Washington due to new regulations on the energy usage of consumer electronics. You guys are probably wondering, well geez Tyler, why did you pronounce Hawaii in that kind of way? It's so strange. Well the main reason I pronounce Hawaii as Hawaii was because basically that's how they pronounced it when I was there. I was on the whole entire island of somewhere called like uh, Kauai, where basically it was like one of the first, you know, things that came out from like the eruptions for the Hawaiian Islands. And actually, of course, I enjoyed my time there. The people were nice. I saw like a lot of freaking stuff, like, you know, the hula dancers and so on. And so, yes. I enjoy my time. It was nice not wearing masks when I was in Hawaii. Okay, why the hell am I talking about Hawaii right now? I'm supposed to talk about this, you know, stupid PC ban that, of course, the government wants to, you know, increase upon the rights of the citizens and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I have to talk about these sort of boring details because, you know, reasons. Life is full of various interesting things, both complicated as well as enjoyable. And obviously, one of the most enjoyable things in life is entertainment. Because you can transform yourself into a different world that is not, of course, uniquely like a part of this world and enjoy just how funny things are, how scary they are. Basically, entertainment is there to entertain. It's part of the name, damn it! When people are forced to have lockdowns and have no choice but to, of course, stay home and transform into those fat people from Wally -E and eat Cheetos and Doritos for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, what kind of activities do you think they will be doing in their free time? Play video games. And so, why should this concern the government what kind of stuff that people had to play in their own freaking home? Why should the government dictate to me, well, this is not, of course, good for the environment, so let's ban the whole entire sale of PCs entirely, because, you see, we care about the environment, we want a virtual signal about the environment, so yeah, no more gaming for you guys, because that's obviously not environmental friendly. Let me remind you guys that this is coming from the same sort of government who get money directly from these sort of millionaire companies and whatnot, and oil companies. And of course, those oil companies sometimes, you know, spill oil in the lakes and whatnot. But surely, a person, a gamer, playing their games on their PC is the worst thing to be worried about, and not the oil spills that they do in the environment, or the mass production of stuff that has like a lot of smog that comes to the factories in the air. Oh no, a person watching TV, playing video games, is basically, you know, the worst person in the entire universe. I have one thing to say to all the people who think 
that it's a good idea to take video games from the comfort of people's houses, go suck a dick, and get your goddamn hands off of my video games. They're not for you to take, they're mine, so I could do whatever I want in my house. As long as it's not legal or promote hatred towards other people, I know for a fact that me playing my games has nothing to do with wanting to save the environment. This is just concern virtual signaling, so get your hands off of people's property. This is our property rights, and so we can properly use it however we want. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. He's your only black friend, so he's your best black friend. I won't <laughs> trade him for another black friend. Because black friends are rare, as you should be aware. He smiles like Richard Pryor, so just sit and stare. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler.